This is the Swiss paddle steamer Lochberg in service on Lake Brienz in public service. She and her power plant were built by Escher Weiss in 1914. The engine is an angle compound with Stevenson valve gear, a high pressure cylinder and a low pressure cylinder then exhaust into a jet condenser. The large eccentric at the end of the engine drives the Edwards type wet air pump and the two single acting feed water pumps which are connected to a walking beam. The walking beam can be disconnected from the eccentric and the pumps operated by hand. You can see the hand iron in the end of the walking beam to drive them with a long handle. One reason the ship is so fast, almost 28 kilometers per hour to be precise, is because she has mechanically feathering paddle wheel blades which change inclination over the course of one wheel revolution to keep them at the best angle. The valve gear is arranged so that turning the reversing wheel through various positions of cutoff varies the high and low pressure cylinders at different rates to optimize the horsepower curve throughout different speeds of running. Say that again. So if you think about, it's an amazing thing, but we got 17 of those operational as public service all summer in the whole country. As normal public, uh, pu public transport with the standard tickets, no steam surcharge or anything. <sighs> yep. You know that you can make a transatlantic crossing with one of these. You're right, that's correct. They, they did that with a lot smaller, the Appleton Hall, the paddle yes, tug. Boiling salt water in the boilers. Do it. You've got a lot to be proud of in this country, Jonas. But there's a, a lot of people that uh, fought for this. Yeah, so there has to be. The ones on uh, here on Lake Brienz and then the Bluemis Alp on Lake Thun, that was like a, a group of, uh, of 15 people in the 70s and 80s that saved them. The only ones that were in constant service were the ones on uh, Lake Geneva. Well, at least a few of them.